Which Man City Academy stars are ready to step up to the first team? Phil Foden once looked up to Manchester City's first team stars so much that he was starstruck in training. Now he's the icon paving the way for the younger generation in Pep Guardiola's squad. The 21 year old is proof that City have it all as a football club. Top finances, state of the art facilities, and now a top class academy producing talent worthy of playing for the Premier League champions. Once the standout academy product in this City team, Foden has been joined by several youth stars that are being brought through by Guardiola this season. The most exciting of which is Cole Palmer, whose expert finish against Club Brugge handed him his first Champions League goal and greater expectation on his shoulders. But after City's 5-1 European win in Belgium, Guardiola dropped an even more exciting claim that five or six more City youngsters are ready to make the step up to the first team this season. Who knows? Guardiola teased. If they continue to be humble and work they can be important for Manchester City. Sportsmail goes through the youngsters Guardiola is tipping to make a breakthrough at Manchester City in the coming year's Cole Palmer position. Midfielder age. 19 first team games. 7, 2 goals, let's start with the man of the moment. Cole Palmer's stock has risen so high that some Manchester City are already calling for the 19-year-old midfielder to start more Premier League games. Palmer curled home a wonderful effort just minutes after coming on in Belgium last Tuesday night, which adds to his delightful goal he netted in City's 6-1 thrashing of Wickham in the Carabao Cup last month. The teenager is very much in the form of his life, having scored a hat trick for City's under-23s team last weekend, just a few hours after playing for the first team in the Premier League against Burnley. Palmer has also taken his goalscoring form to the youth international stage, scoring two goals in three matches for England's under-21s team where he is mixing with established Premier League stars such as Emil Smith-Rowe, Curtis Jones and Connor Gallagher. The midfielder has been at City since the age of eight, rejecting an offer Manchester United in the process, despite coming from the same suburb as Marcus Rashford. Before joining City, Palmer also had trials at Liverpool and Bolton, but failed to impress the academy staff there, while he was nearly culled from the Etihad Academy a few years ago for being too small. Now over six feet and impressing at first-team level, Guardiola has called for patience regarding Palmer's development. The people in this world want things immediately, but everything needs time, Guardiola said. You cannot cook a good dish if you don't spend time in the kitchen. Cole has a special quality that's difficult to find, he finishes it most of the time. He's training with us and taking our principles. He's a player for the future of this club. Liam Delap position? Striker age. 18 first-team games. 3, 1 goal, Liam Delap may only be 18, but he's technically Manchester City's first choice centre forward at the club. With Gabriel Jesus being used in a wide role, Delap is the only recognised number 9 option, though Guardiola does like to use a false 9 in matches, which rotates between Raheem Sterling, Kevin De Bruyne and Phil Foden. Delap is yet to feature for the City first team this season, though did make his breakthrough last term, when Sergio Aguero first got injured, and Guardiola was lacking options up front. The son of former Stoke long thrower Rory scored in a Carabao Cup third-round victory against Bournemouth last season and made his Premier League debut three days later in a 5-2 home loss to Leicester City. He made one more first-team appearance under Guardiola before going back to City's under-23s team, where he scored 24 goals in 20 matches in the Premier League 2. Delap was approached by several championship clubs over a potential loan move, but Guardiola was very keen to keep him, despite the offer of playing more professional football. Liam Delap, for me, and for the club, is so important for the future Guardiola said in August. He is going to train with us if a striker comes or doesn't come. He will train with us all season. Sam Adozi position. Winger age. 18 first team games. One young winger Sam Adozi was a surprise name in City's starting lineup for the Community Shield defeat to Leicester City back in August. The 18-year-old impressed for City's youth sides and turned out for both the under-18 and under-23 teams last season, ending the campaign with seven goals and five assists in nearly 30 games. Adozi then trained with the first team over the pre-season calendar and scored in all three friendlies against EFL sides Preston, Barnsley and Blackpool which earned him a spot in the Community Shield starting lineup at Wembley. The winger is clearly highly rated at the Etihad Stadium, and City reportedly paid a seven-figure fee to take him from Millwall's academy in 2019, meaning the Premier League champions are backing the teenager to kick on. Adozi has not yet featured for the first team since his Wembley outing, but keep an eye on the name. Luke, MBTE position. Defender age. 
18 first team games. One City's academy starlet are not just attacking players, there are plenty of promising defensive options that Guardiola is keeping an eye on. The most defensive of those players is Luke Mbeat, who started City's 6-1 Carabao Cup win over Wickham Wanderers and is looking forward to more first-team opportunities. Mbeat has been at the club for five years after he was poached by City from Brentford, who closed their academy five years ago, to set up their B-team setup. The 18-year-old used to be a striker when he was playing in West London, but the Bees helped him transition into a defender, where Guardiola is using him in the first-team setup now. Speaking about his first team debut against Wickham last month, Mbeat said. I think we coped with it very well. We're young, but we didn't take that into consideration. We played like it was a normal game. The players and the fans helped us a lot, they were brilliant. And obviously the support from Pep Guardiola as well and the staff behind the scenes. Romeo Lavia position. Defensive midfielder age. 17 first team games. 1. The youngest of academy hopefuls looking to break into the Manchester City first team this season is 17-year-old Belgian midfielder Romeo Lavia. The teenager was spotted by Pep Guardiola himself while the City boss was attending the KDB Cup, a youth tournament hosted by club midfielder Kevin De Bruyne in his native Belgium that he invited the Spanish manager to. A year after Guardiola's scouting mission, Lavia joined the City Academy and was voted as the under-23s player of the season as his side won the Premier League 2 title. Like Mbeat, Lavia was handed his first team debut in the thumping win over Wickham and picked up his first professional booking in the process. Lavia, who is a Belgium under-19 international, admits he is learning off City club captain Fernandinho, while the teenager is also a fan of Sergio Busquets, who Guardiola managed at Barcelona. I've watched a lot of Fernandinho and Busquets the teenager told Goal. Those two have dominated the game as defensive midfielders. I've looked at them a lot. Fernandinho knows what he's doing he doesn't run just to run. He's like the brain of the team. When you're young you want to run left, right, but he knows what he's doing so he won't run as much, but will still be effective. That's something I keep learning from him. I've spoken to him but not in person because of COVID, so just on social media.